Where are we off to then? Straight to the titty bar. <laughs> As you can see, we made it to London. The train was a bit of an excursion. It was absolutely packed, so we had to stand for most of the time. But nevertheless, we made it. We are here. And uh, now we're going to head over to Nando's and get some lunch. Nice. So we're in London and we're here for a represent event, but we've got a couple hours before we have to start getting ready for the event tonight. So I thought, let's go sneaker shopping. But with the fact that Adidas has dropped Yeezy and obviously Adidas started telling all of their retailers to take Yeezys off of the shop floors, let's go and find out what these retailers are actually doing in London with their Yeezys. Have Adidas actually told them to take the Yeezys off of the shop floor and are they planning to stop selling them immediately? Can we find some Yeezys sat around in some stores? Well, let's go and find out. They're, they're having all their Yeezys out. It's like Yeezy 10K, bro. How much, are, how much are these ones? Um, 18,000. 18? Do you have like all the colors or just this one? No, just the other one. Obviously all this stuff will be planning is happening. So we thought we'd go around. Um, I feel like because some of it, obviously now with what's happening with Kanye, yeah. everything's going to go up now. Yeah. But in here, I don't think it's going to go up that drastic. Yeah. But what he's done, obviously like, Oh my God. <laughs> I still like Yeezys, but yeah. I was outraged what you said. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. obviously I don't condone it, yeah. but you need to understand that when someone is like has that personality, it's hard for you to be like, okay, cool. Hundred percent. Really come to it. Uncle, your friends like that, you're gonna cater. Like, Yo, bro, what's up? You need, you need yeah. counseling. You need therapy. I got you, that mean. Yeah, you went to Skechers. Yeah, yeah, went to the Skechers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> went to Skechers. I was come like, on, yeah, yeah, how are you gonna go to Skechers? Yeah. Is this the uh, the one that recently released or the like the, old one? This is from 2015. It's the original. Oh, okay. man. Mm. We only do OGs, man. We don't. So we ended up going to a few sneaker stores here in London and the issue is that a lot of them ended up asking us not to record in their stores or just didn't want to talk about what they were doing with Yeezys. I was expecting places like Offspring or Foot Patrol to potentially have some stock left over as they did have a lot of Yeezys sitting online earlier this month but nothing. Now resale stores were obviously still selling them and I think some of them have actually put their prices up because they were taxing on Yeezy sneakers. They go to Foot Patrol and they actually had some sick pairs sitting on shelves pretty much all of the recent jordan ones like the taxis varsity red stealths heirloom starfish brotherhood ones we got the j balvin twos panda highs 26s which was pretty crazy because they dropped ages ago like where the hell did they get pairs of those from also had napolitan and dark iris threes we headed to end clothing which literally had nothing in terms of sneakers but i did cop a couple different pieces of clothing which i will show you guys later we headed back to the hotel to get ready for the represent event all right so we're headed to the represent pre-party before the event so here is the outfit we got blue jeans Sakai vapor waffles in the sale white colorway we got to represent varsity because of course we got to be repping the brand <laughs> Day number two, represent event. We've got to be at this event at half nine. The event officially starts at 10 o'clock. Yeah, essentially it's going to be the represent sample sale and they're expecting an insane turnout. So you guys are going to see people who have been literally queuing all night long to get into this place. Finally opening the doors for them. How are we, man? How are we doing, bro? You good? Yeah, you okay? Yeah. Exactly. That's sure. I need to get myself a pair, bro. Right. Yeah. You good? Yeah. It's fresh. We 
We just finished up at the Represent event and we just dropped our bags off back at the hotel. So now we're headed to London Bridge to go and buy a pair of sneakers. We're meeting up with the guy that I've been speaking to on Instagram. He gave me a little deal. He actually gave me a good deal on this pair. I'm not going to tell you what pair of sneakers it is, so we'll just wait till we get there and uh, you guys can find out. Alright, we're waiting for the guy to pull up and then we're going to buy the sweet ass Halloween pair of sneakers. Get it on the vlog. Hey, you get extra patches? Yeah. I'll shop that at two. It looks sick, man. Damn. Do this, man. Yeah, Appreciate it, bro. Hey. I got you. And we are back in the studio. So guys, it is the next day and the actual journey back from London was way better than the journey up there. You guys saw how packed that train was. At least we got a seat on the way back. But I do want to show you guys what I managed to pick up when I was in London because we got some clothing pieces. And of course, I want to show you guys the sneakers that I managed to get. But let's start with the clothing. And obviously I got a lot from the represent sample sale. And you can find a lot of stuff that's like never been seen before, which I think is really, really cool. So some of the stuff that I got, the first thing I got this cap actually, which is a sample. I don't think they ever sold this on their website. And then I got the exclusive hoodie from the event, which says staff on the back and obviously says London at the bottom. I just thought like the colors on it and just the fact that it's from the pop-up I thought was so cool. And then I managed to get a huge leather jacket, which I'm super hyped about. It is insane quality. Like it's super heavy duty. It is incredibly warm. So it's going to keep me nice and toasty this winter. Literally as you're wearing it, you can smell the leather. It's just insane quality. Other than that, I got a couple different items like a tote bag and I also got a belt and some socks but I didn't really get that much it was like my brother got a lot more than I actually did moving on to the sneakers of course guys you know I had to do it I posted on my Instagram story that I took an L on this pair and I really really wanted it so one of my followers actually reached out to me and was like yo I'm in London I'm selling my pair do you want it and I was like hell yeah here they are in hand Man, of course, today is Halloween, October 31st. I had to get this pair. Like, this is probably my favorite Halloween sneaker to release in a long time. This is the Neck Face Nike Dunk Low. All of the patches are completely unique. So, like, from the left shoe to the right shoe, all of the patches are different. They've got, like, a super grungy look to them. And what I thought was really interesting is, like, the extra laces you get with this sneaker are literally black. They are the same as the one, like, the same style. I don't even know why they bothered adding an extra pair of laces in. You get like some extra patches in there. Pull these out and let me show you guys. I don't think these are for the shoes or at least it's not like a Velcro thing that you can like pull off one patch and then slap another one on. So I'm not entirely sure. I think they just give you these patches just to have. Maybe throw on like a denim jacket or something if you're rocking that as well. Let me know down in the comments if you managed to get a pair of these things. Happy Halloween. We are celebrating with this pair of sneakers. So as I got home from London, I saw this box waiting for me. This is an early pair that is actually going to be dropping tomorrow. It is No Two Ways latest sneaker. Oh man, they killed this colorway. Take a look at that guys. Just in time for fall, this is the khaki colorway. You do get an extra pair of laces in the box. You've got little metal aglets on there, so it really feels extra premium. Man, No Two Ways makes some insane sneakers. Quality that you get with No Two Ways for the price tag. I'm not joking guys, it is absolutely insane. You've got the Super premium feeling suede covering the toe box and the overlays and then of course the base is that super soft leather material like you don't find this on a hundred hundred and ten pound sneaker like as you know guys I've been rocking their white colorway that released last like I wear these things a lot and this one is just all over solid leather but yeah just a heads up guys these are gonna be dropping tomorrow that is November the first they're gonna be dropping 6 p.m. British Standard Time if you do want a pair definitely be ready on the website because yeah these things fly people love it and I think at the retail price that they are, it is a solid cop. Well done, Calyx, and everybody at No Two Ways for creating this sneaker. I absolutely love it, and thank you guys for sending this through. But yeah, guys, that is everything I managed to get. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Thank you guys so much for coming through, hanging out for yet again another video. Thank you for liking, commenting, and of course, subscribing. I'll catch you guys in the next one. But until then, oh, and ha happy Halloween, guys, as well.